Hi Hildren! It's me, Hilda. Um, you recently watched a video of me, two days ago, where I showed you too many Funko Pops. Um, I'm just going to do a regular monthly nerdgasm right now, wearing the same shirt, recording it right after the other one, because I'm great, and why the fuck not, am I right? <laughs> This will not involve any Funko Pop, so if that's the only reason you follow me, get the heck out of here and let's just fucking start. <laughs> I'm gonna start with the t-shirts. The first one is this t-shirt. It's a Deadpool shirt from QWERTY called Waiting for Francis. Oh yes, yeah. I, I like me some Deadpool, but we all know that. We all know that. This month I got so many fucking t-shirts, it's not normal, so I'm just gonna grab them, I guess. Ugh. All right. The first one that... No, actually the second one, because I already showed you this one. The second one I got this month is this awesome design of... Um... BB-8 and Poe Dameron. Dameron, I cannot say his name ever. Um, made by the amazingly talented Amanda Flag. I think this came from T Fury. It was one of those once in a lifetime t-shirts. But if you're if you really like artists who are cool then uh, go to her Twitter which I will link here somewhere on the screen. Next up is I got three t-shirts by one of my favorite artists Miski and um, this one is one I was after for a long long time and then finally there was a discount on um, the I think it was Redbubble. Was it Redbubble? I don't know. Society 6? I don't know. On the, on the store, um, it is an awesome Pokemon shirt, it has Gloom, Gloom? No, it does not have Gloom, it has Vile, Vile Plume and Oddish and uh, there's no Oddish on here, what am I saying? It is one of those amazing Pokemon designs that I love, um, I love pretty much every Pokemon design she ever made, but it's hard to choose, so I just went for a few of them. <laughs> I also got this shirt uh, right on the day I got Pokémon Tournament, I got this shirt, which is kind of a cross shirt between Pokémon Tournament and Street Fighter, which are two fighting games that I truly love a lot. So that always also made me really happy. Also, I like Armika, she has a nice butt. And another shirt by Miski is this uh, tank top. I actually didn't remember ordering the tank top, but it's a tank top. And it is my the most favorite design she ever made, like my most favorite design, because it is an ivy saw with some oddish in a little tank and it is the cutest thing ever. Um, I will also link Miski's Twitter down here because um, most of these shirts are available in her shops and she is just really one of my favorite artists so please go check out her stuff. Then another Deadpool shirt is this one. Now I wore this shirt to the Dutch Comic Con and I got so many comments about it and everyone was like that is the best shirt I've ever seen. And I was like yeah. I know, it is the best shirt ever. Look at it, look how good it is. It is the best fucking shirt. I love One Punch Man, I love Deadpool. I'm not the biggest Dragon Ball Z fan, but my boyfriend is and I got him the same shirt for our first year anniversary, woohoo! Speaking of our one year anniversary, he got me this shirt, which is the Pokemon 20 V-neck and it is really cute. Um, let me just look, just look at them, just look at it. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It has all the starters and it is just the best thing. And then I also got a shirt from um, one of my favorite streamers, Koali Bears. Really good shirt. You should check her out as well. I'll, I'll just fucking link everyone in here. Doesn't matter. Go check out Koali Bears. She's lovely. That's the shirts. For our one year anniversary, my boyfriend got me this Pokeball. Um from uh, the Phoenix Orb project. It's not working right now. Okay, I may have drained the battery because I didn't turn it off. Anyway, um, this thing glows and it um, also vibrates when you press this button, um, but it is now not working because the battery is empty and that is really stupid of me. It is a really, really cool gift and I love it a lot. These are custom made by by some company. Um, they sell them on Etsy and um, I think it's really cool. The only thing I'm not a really big fan of is that it is just one of those plastic balls you buy in the store and they modded it. 
Um, so it doesn't feel like really Pokeball-ish. It doesn't feel really qualitatively heavy. It doesn't make it less awesome though. I still really love this. It came with a little stand. I'm gonna put it back on the stand now. <laughs> Next up, I got some Pokemon plushies. Um, of course, Raichu. I just, as soon as I saw this, I was like, I need to get this Raichu because it's so fucking cute. I am in love with these sleeping Pokemon, like this line of sleepy Pokemon. They are the cutest. I have Slowpoke, Raichu, and Vaporeon, and Espa, and look how cute they are. I don't know if you can tell by the way, but I kind of lost my voice this weekend, so I sound a bit sultry or something. That's not the right word, but I don't care. So here we go. Next up are the Amiibo. Woo! This month! My favorite boy, Ryu, came out as an amiibo and I think it is amazing. Look at them legs. I'm just very disappointed. It is not the beardy Ryu because he is sexy. Either way, good amiibo. And from the Smash line, I also got the Villager. Um, I, I got them from this website where a lot of amiibo were on discount and I kind of had my eye on this one for a while. So I thought I'd just get it. Looks cool with my Animal Crossing amiibo collection. So there's that. And speaking of the Animal Crossing amiibo collection, I also got Mr. Rossetti and Cap'n. I don't even know how to say that, but uh, Captain, who I, I love so much in all the Animal Crossing games. I love the way he sings to me. I love the way he looks. Captain is my bae. And Rossetti is just a little angry boy. So they can be friends now and stand next to all my Animal Crossing friends. So I think uh, that was it for the normal items that I got, the regular items. And of course it wouldn't be me if I didn't forget to do a thing in the video and found out about it while I was editing it. And in this case it is saying bye and this is really awkward so I'm just going to say bye now. Bye!